How you doing? Hey. Look for Miss. She it work. Okay, this is an eviction. Really? That's what it is. How many people in here? Just um, me and my four children. I didn't know nothing about this. Are you the leaseholder? Um, she is. She's at work. She gets off at six. You might need to call her. Wow. Okay. Any weapons, anything like that in here? I don't own a weapon. I'm just offering my brother out. My brother and his girlfriend house for a little while. Wow, let me call him. Yeah. So what, everything has to get out the house right now? Yep, that's what we're here for. I'm going to set it out. Wow. Now the way this works is I come in. I take pictures of everything. Once I get my pictures taken, the crew comes in, we start setting it out. Well, can I have a minute to call them, please? Because I didn't know nothing. Sorry, this is so shocking to me. Well, evictions don't, this is how evictions work. As soon as I show here, whoever was living here don't live here anymore. Really? Or so, right. I did not, I promise that I don't know nothing about it. Yeah. Well, a lot of people don't understand how evictions work. But it's not one of them things where I can come back and come on, you don't live here no more. It's the eviction. That's, a, wow. that's what it is. Okay, can I move my own things? Do I have to? Please? Well, that's what an eviction yeah. is. Well, it's, my cousin say that's what I'm saying. Can I move my kids? Can I do that at least? Get my kids out the way, please? Sir? Well, yeah, you have to get the kids out. And that's why I'm going to come in and take my pictures. And while I'm doing that, what I would advise you to do is uh -huh. you got any jewelry, money. Yes. Cell phones, that kind of stuff. Go ahead and gather that stuff up because uh -huh. you don't want us putting that in a bag. Please don't put my stuff in a bag, sir. And that's what I'm saying. So go ahead and start gathering that stuff up while I'm taking my pictures. And then you need to get the kids. She has, girl, she has the eviction girl. They're here to pull her stuff out. Uh, the eviction people, tell me to come up here and help me, please. Yes, girl, yes. Excuse me, sir. Okay, so what do you think? I just drove down the street and just came over here. No, sir, we're not saying that. I mean, come on, you got to just get think about think about stuff now. We, 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 I understand that, but you have to justify why I'm here. The only your, your own answer to why I'm here is a, is a mistake. I mean, come on now, it ain't no mistake. This is a writ from Gerald Sessions Court for this. Okay. Girl, your stuff is gonna get put out. Yeah. It is uh sheriff, police, or something here to put everything out, take a picture. Great. I don't know. He said that some is to get the eviction, girl. I'm talking about they gonna take everything out the house right now. Okay, here she go, here she go. Yeah, they need somebody to come get them right now as soon as possible. Cause she they they she's on the phone. Who's this? Yeah, that's the um the owner of this house. Hello. Hello? Hello, sir? Yes. I have been paying my bills. Hello, I have been paying my bills and I have paid that woman. Okay, but here, here's uh, the here's the problem. Let, let me explain something to you. I all I do is evictions. What? That's what I do. I don't collect okay, rent. I don't I know been, been, I'm, well, I'm trying to explain okay, it to you because I, been, I, I don't have no discretion. I don't have anything that no, you can explain. Well, you need to call General Sessions Court, man. You want me to give you the docket number? General Sessions Court is the one who issued this. A judge from General Sessions Court. You might need to contact General Sessions. General Sessions Court. General Sessions Court. I don't know if I get the number. 
Hold on. Let me see if I got the number. Okay, the number. You're gonna pick that one right. Three. You want your docket number? Yeah, you want your docket number? Uh, that's the area, what's the area code? Area code is not on one of them. Yes. You should take that one and see if you put you at your house. It don't make no sense. Oh. Then I'm going to give Uh, you can, you can send me that, uh, you can, uh, send me that document number. No, I'm not going to just tell you the document number. Okay, you can. Yes. Is it 901? No, this is your docket number for your court case. Uh, 205. Hey, somebody's trying to buzz in on your phone. I don't even care about that, sir. Okay, I'm sure I'll be calling them in the or in the first minute and right after I get off the top. Okay. All okay. right. Meet you on the way to get y'all. Meet you on the way to get y'all. Meet you. Okay, tell her to be outside. Well, you need to come and talk to him. He's doing his job. He's taking pictures. He said, this no longer your home. Call Kiki and y'all gonna come on. We're here. Uh, let me. I'm not trying to be rude with y'all. This is the. It's a tough situation, but let me explain to you how it works. I'm the one who does the eviction, but I'm not the cause of the eviction. Mm -hmm. And what people do when I get here, they want to start trying to explain it to me. Mm -hmm. But it ain't but two people that's in charge, either the landlord or the court. It ain't me. Yeah. So that's why a lot of times when I'm on eviction, people talk, I'm like, well, call the court. You see this is from the court, but they don't want to call the court because they already know what the court going to say. Yeah, she went to yeah, court, though, and they the next day after they went to court. Yeah, and we right. thought everything was done. We found the home one thousand some dollars. Yeah, they pay her what they owe. So, is she evicted them? Oh, something else. Sometimes she be evicted. Nah, I really not. She's evicted now, so he wasn't evicted no more. So this just got brought up out of the blue. Yeah, we don't know. So, so, are you saying that they they not behind or they? They're not. Okay, but here's the here's the thing now, and that could be true, but more than likely, I'm just saying from my experience doing this, people ain't putting nobody out there paying rent. Yeah. I mean, not in this time. If you caught up on your rent, they ain't putting you out. Why can't she get a notice or something? Yeah, you know, your court is the notice. I hear that all. I promise you, I hear that all the time. But you get, you go to court, and that's why you have to deal with the court. If you didn't get no notice or the court doing you wrong, then that's where your issues at is with the people who issued this. They waiting on you. So this is where it's at. Like. She said she call and I'm gonna call down there, but the but but what I normally see with that is, uh -huh. if people already know, somebody everybody around them not gonna know. Yeah. Now what's your <laughs> so, name? Neil. Neil Penn. Now the only problem I had with you was when I came in here, you like, well, you think I'm coming over or anything? I think because black people we need to have more respect for each other. Because I'm at college. Now, now I I preach that what you're talking about. Yeah, and you we we are we are the most un. Yeah, and now you're being now you're being. I'm respect. always like that. I'm always the same way. But like, it's people come at me. No, Somebody, no. you're not on no lease or nothing. You coming in here, and I'm like, well, I'm not. 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 I'
I need to see this paper. You the one out of order. You trying to put it on me, but it's you that's out of order. I'm in my official capacity doing what I'm supposed to do. Yeah, I, I ain't even supposed to have nobody in here at all. I could have just come straight in and told her to step outside. I don't do that though. I don't do it that way. But there are servers and sheriffs that come in and say, everybody outside right now. And you want me and you that's it. You outside. You trespassing. Yeah. But I don't understand why it was no notice. She that's all I'm saying. I don't think she told him it's paid the money the next day, and they went and paid her the next day. Then she probably didn't. Well, uh, well, here's my thing. I, like I say, I don't know what's old. It could be no money old. Yeah. However, yeah. just for me doing this every day, more than likely, she it's a lot of money old. That's why it, it's an eviction. Yeah, they can evict she for. There's no reason why she's getting evicted. Just the eviction. Well, like if, when when the, sometimes you can just be evicted, like if it's been drugs or something yeah. like that. Yeah. But ninety nine percent of the time, it's over money. Yeah. I'm trying to see. Okay, this went through court October the fourteenth. Uh huh. So. You scared me. I didn't know what to think when I seen you. Well, you know, it, it, it's a I tough thing. Maybe they had the wrong because you said she said. She did. Oh, there was she, there. The receipt in there. She did. But see, I'm gonna tell you what I get though. This, this is why I can Sometimes you have to be a little harsh because people come at you like it's my fault. So I have to let people know. Wait a minute now. I think if, it's because it's we, so we don't. It's, we it's, 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 it's no warning. It just happened out the blue. Right. I would have got my kids out of here. Like I don't know. She young. She yeah, but she probably knew though. Yeah. You didn't know. You have to remember. You the leaseholder. It's the one you're going to communicate with. And she told me they just paid money. She didn't say anything about evicting them, though. Well, I don't know about that. That's the whole game right there. That's the whole game. But go ahead and get off and go ahead and bring this crew in. And we're going to start setting this up.